Eric Frederick Trump is an American businessman, activist, and former reality television presenter. He is the third child and second son of U.S. President-elect Donald Trump and Ivana Trump. Trump is a trustee and executive vice president of his father's business, the Trump Organization. Running it alongside his older brother Donald Jr., he also served as a boardroom judge on his father's television series, The Apprentice. During their father's presidency, the brothers invested in foreign countries and collected payments in their U.S. properties from foreign governments, despite having pledged not to do so. Early Life Eric Trump was born in New York City and attended Trinity School. His parents divorced in 1990 when he was six years old. As a boy, Trump spent his summers in the Czech countryside near Zlin with his maternal grandparents. His grandfather, Milos Zelnasek, who died in 1990, was an engineer. His grandmother, Maria, worked in a shoe factory. His grandfather taught Trump to hunt and fish. In 2002, Trump graduated from the Hill School. He graduated with a degree in finance and management from Georgetown University in Washington, D.C. Trump started accompanying his father to job sites and negotiations from a young age. He has said he mowed lawns, laid tiles, and did other work on his father's properties in his youth. Trump briefly considered other careers, but decided to join the family business while a high school student. Personal Life On July 4, 2013, Trump became engaged to his longtime girlfriend Lara Leah Unaska, an associate producer on the syndicated television news program Inside Edition. They married on November 8, 2014, at the Mar-a-Lago Club in Palm Beach, Florida. The couple's first child, Eric Luke Trump, a son, was born in September 2017, and their daughter, Carolina Dorothy, in August 2019. In April 2021, Trump and his wife acquired a $3.2 million home in Jupiter, Florida. In March 2022, Trump joined other members of his family in switching his official residency from New York to Florida. Trump is an avid outdoorsman and big game hunter. Net Worth Eric Trump is an American businessman and philanthropist who has a net worth of $350 million. Eric Trump is probably best known for being the second son of Donald Trump. Eric often appeared with his father on the reality show The Apprentice. Following his father's involvement in politics and his victory in the 2016 U.S. presidential election, Eric became a vocal and public supporter of the Trump presidency. He is also a successful businessman and plays a key role in the Trump organization. Personal Real Estate Eric's primary residence is a four-unit apartment above Central Park in a building called Trump Park East. He also owns a duplex on the grounds of Trump National Golf Club in Westchester County, New York. Career The Trump Organization Eric Trump, Executive Vice President of Development and Acquisitions at the Trump Organization, has been criticized for his role in the Trump-Ukraine scandal. He claimed that the Trump family stopped doing international business deals after his father became president, but when Trump became president, he made him a top executive in the family business. Trump has also stated that they rely on funding from Russia and that Russians make up a disproportionate cross-section of their assets. In 2019, Trump complained about the Biden's political enrichment and decided to hold the G7 summit at the Trump Doral Resort. A ruling in 2024 barred Trump from serving as an officer or director of any New York corporation or legal entity in New York. Television Trump, a boardroom judge on reality TV show The Apprentice, established the Eric Trump Foundation in 2007 to raise money for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital in Tennessee. The foundation committed to raising $20 million over 10 years for the naming rights to the new Eric Trump Foundation Surgery and ICU Center. Since 2006, the foundation has raised $6 million for St. Jude. In 2016, Trump announced he would stop active fundraising for the foundation to avoid appearing that donors were using him to gain access to his father after the election. Funds Usage The Eric Trump Foundation raised and donated $16.3 million to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital in 2016, but Forbes reported that over $1.2 million of the donations went to the Trump Organization for the use of Trump's Westchester Golf Course. 
the foundation had advertised that its golf charity events raised money exclusively for the charity, with 95 to 100 percent going toward the charity. Public tax records show that the foundation applied significant amounts of the funds raised to pay costs of the events to the Trump Organization for use of its facilities. The foundation also donated to charitable causes other than St. Jude and made grants to several other charities. In June 2017, the New York State Attorney General's office confirmed that an inquiry into the Eric Trump Foundation began, which was reported as ongoing in December 2018. Trump Presidential Campaigns 2016 Presidential Campaign Donald Trump's 2016 presidential campaign was formally launched on June 16, 2015, at Trump Tower in New York City. Eric was a key advisor, fundraiser, and campaign surrogate during the campaign. He and his wife made campaign appearances in numerous states on his father's behalf. On August 2, 2016, in a television appearance on CBS This Morning, Trump was asked to comment on his father's controversial statement to USA Today the previous day in which he said that if his daughter were ever subjected to sexual harassment in the workplace, he hoped she would find another company to work for or switch careers. Trump said, Ivanka is a strong, powerful woman. She wouldn't allow herself to be objected to it. Michael Cohen Reimbursement Payments On May 28th, 2024, an email was shown during defense closing arguments in Donald Trump's New York criminal trial which revealed that longtime Trump Organization Comptroller Jeffrey McConaughey, who was previously acknowledged to have organized Trump Sr.'s reimbursement payments to Michael Cohen following the Hush Honey payments Cohen made to Stormy Daniels, sought approval from both Eric Trump and Donald Trump Jr. It has been acknowledged that Eric Trump had signed some of the reimbursement checks to Cohen as well. Conspiracy Theories and Attempts to Overturn the 2020 Presidential Election In May 2020, Trump claimed stay-at-home orders were a strategy by Democrats and the Joe Biden campaign to prevent his father's re-election. He spread a false video in September 2020, claiming Biden was caught using a teleprompter. Following his father's defeat, Trump attempted to overturn the 2020 election, falsely calling it a fraud and threatening Republican lawmakers. He also made baseless claims about Pennsylvania's ballot counting process. 